I want to say that I've been very frustrated with the lack of the delivery of laptops to at least the first year students in the community college for the arts and general studies, technical and teacher education. We have enough laptops for those three divisions. We may even have for the nurses who have just gone in. Um, but they have approximately the database shows we have about 992 laptops. Meaning, I was trying to see if I could get for everybody at the community college. But the source of the money which I was trying to get for everybody, for, really for the second year, the mon that money is slow in coming. But it doesn't make sense to keep those which are there. We just have to explain to the students what we are doing. And, and these first year students, they need the laptops to do all their their coursework programs and so on and so on. Why have them locked up there? And I know that they were waiting, quite genuinely waiting on me to see if I could get the additional money to get those coming. But it's, give out what you have. <laughs> the students will understand. And always up for the openness and transparency process. And we have a, quite a substantial number there. They, for instance, for year one, they said to me, they have teacher education 63 in year one. Technical 337. Well, technical really should be about 400. But about 78 of them not registered yet for one reason or the other. Don't know why. They should get registered. And arts and general studies, 455. But they, they have about 500 there who are actually properly registered. About 60 or so not, not properly registered yet. So we should have enough to cover those who are registered in those three areas. Well, from the numbers which they give me. And they tell me in their database they have 992 laptops. They tell me that one of the secondary schools had miscalculated and they have to give the secondary school a few. But we'll, we'll take that in our strides. And I want to thank Ms. Gilchrist, who is the Chief Education Officer, and I want to thank Ms. Ramsamuj and the Permanent Secretary, who is on leave, I understand, for a short while, and the Minister of Education, and Camilo, who is Minister of Technology, and they're working together on this. And I want to thank all of them for the material which they have sent for me in relation to the, the, the decisions so that we can take these, these decisions.